Hi everyone, it's Talia and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So, for today's video, I'm going to be following what Kendall Jenner eats in a day. I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually really excited for this day of eating because I feel like Kendall is like one of the only models that has like, I don't wanna say it's a semi-normal diet, but you know, there's nothing too adventurous in the diet. So I'm super interested to see how we get on for today. However, first thing this morning, what Kendall does in the morning is she goes for a workout. So cue the 7 a.m. workout montage. Come a little bit closer. Yeah, yeah. Come a little bit closer. Yeah. So all my ladies who got a brother that doesn't treat them right. Put your finger right in his face and tell that man bye-bye. I'm too fly. I'm too fly. Bye-bye. So it is currently breakfast time and this is what breakfast looks like. I feel like it is just focusing on my face. Focus on the breakfast please camera. Have you got it? There we go. So for breakfast, Kendall obviously has toast with avocado and an egg. And if I'm honest, okay, I hate avocado. I don't mind guacamole. Guac, guac, whatever you want to call it. But like, why does everyone eat avocado? Like, I just don't understand the hype. Like, I just can't, I just can't get on with it, okay? So, as you guys probably saw from the aesthetic montage of me making my breakfast, I have actually bought, like, a pre-made smashed avocado to see if I like it. Not gonna lie, I tried a little bit and it was very salty. And we only had one egg, unfortunately. So, you know, I wasn't very well prepared for this video. But... This is what we've got to work with. So I'm going to give just, do you know what? I actually don't need a knife and fork for this. I'm just going to pick it up. I'm going to try just the plain one at first. It's not too bad, okay? This is definitely better than whenever I tried to make my own avocado on toast. Um, but I just don't get the avocado hype. There's actually a chunk of avocado here. So I'm going to try that bit. I just don't get it. I thought I'd bring you guys down here so we can open up the egg and hope that it's runny. Perfect. Okay, let's try the toast with the egg and the avocado. I feel like the egg definitely makes it better, but I think the reason why it makes it better is because it's so like overpowering in the taste. It's just not a bit of me. I mean, it's not the worst breakfast I've ever had. I've definitely had worse breakfasts whilst making videos, um, but definitely... I don't know, not, I'm just not an avocado girl, okay? So it is currently lunchtime, it is 12.38 and I have my bottle of water here because I don't think I mentioned earlier, but Kendall is very big on like hydration, water, detox teas, the whole shebang. So for lunch today, this is what we have. Try and show you guys properly. This is probably the most like substantial, I follow the couple of models diets by this point and this is probably the most substantial lunch that i've ever seen or ever come across a model eating so do i think kendall jenner shops in ms absolutely not but i was gonna make chicken and do it in spices and i saw this at ms and it's cajun chicken breasts so i bought it and it was also reduced so save myself some money and do i think kendall also gets microwaved rice no but she probably has a private chef so technically it's like it's already done for her so I'm just doing it, but you know, the cheaper way. Mmm. That chicken is really nice. I don't know if I even probably explain what I'm having, but she has brown rice and chicken. Sounds kind of boring. But it tastes really good. And to be honest, it takes it back to the days where I used to really watch what I used to eat. And I used to have chicken and rice for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, basically. You're a little bit selfish You get mad every time you lose You can't take me with you I'm scared you're gonna blow your fuse Come a little bit closer Yeah I can really start over Yeah In the back of 
So it is coming up to three o'clock and I am feeling a little bit peckish. So we're going to have a snack. So this is what my snack plate is looking like. So Kendall likes a snack on veggies and hummus and also fruit. So I'm not going to, I don't think, I'm pretty sure she does not dip her fruit into the hummus. So I've just got some cucumber to dip in my hummus. Mmm. This is a really nice hummus, it's red pepper. And then for afters, I've just got some strawberries. Hello everyone, so it is currently, what is the time? Oh god, I'm just changing my alarm. 17.40, 20 to 6, and it is currently dinner time. I've actually only just finished work because I was working a longer day today. So I am very much looking forward to my dinner, and my dinner is a nice, quick and easy one. So I feel like... The Kardashians, they love their sushi. Kendall said that her favourite takeout is either sushi or Italian. And I feel like I'm going to get hate for this. I'm not like the biggest Italian food fan going. Sushi has my heart. So I have two packs of sushi here. I have a spicy salmon crunch roll and a veggie crunch roll. And I also have some gyoza here with some soy sauce and sweet chilli sauce. I'm honestly... I actually can't explain how excited I am for this. This is a good gyoza. We're gonna try one of the salmon rolls. I'm a little bit scared because it says that it's spicy. And uh, we all know how I feel about spice. Not very, not, not a big fan. Am I getting spice? Mm. Yeah, okay. It's a bit of a, a bit of an after kick on the spice. Mm, yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm starting to get it now. I thought I had uh, trained my taste buds. Yeah. It's quite spicy in my throat, but it tastes really, really good. I feel like I would have had a lot of rice today after the sushi. Obviously, I had rice for lunch, rice for dinner. However, I am personally more of a rice girl over a noodle girl. So I'm not complaining. We have another goes up and then we're gonna try the veggie sushi. So in this roll, I think there is carrot, avocado, and cucumber. And then obviously it's got some kind of sauce on the top, I don't really know. And I don't know if this is like onion on the top. A bit of soy sauce. Hmm. A little bit boring, but Beggars can't be choosers. I always forget how filling sushi is. I think like one roll is not going to be enough. I need at least like two to three and sides. But I forget it's rice and like there's a lot going on with rice. It really is a filling food. You're just wasting my time because you're scared and only finally got some closure. Yeah, I can finally start over. It is a little while after dinner, not gonna lie, I have got the biggest stomach ache and I think it's because I've eaten quite a bit of rice today and I don't know if me and rice are the best of friends anymore because I've got a real bad stomach ache. However, for dessert, when I was reading the article online about what Kendall eats, it said that she likes to snack on Twixes as well. And I can only assume Twixes in the US are the same thing as the UK, I know some things are like slightly different, but if you guys are long time viewers, then you will know that I used to literally live on Twixes. Like I used to have multiple Twixes a day and there are some more downstairs, so I may go downstairs and get another one after this. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. I feel like I've had a really good day of eating, not gonna lie. Kind of feel like I sometimes 
minus avocado kind of eat like this on an everyday basis so i feel like i've had a really good day of eating but i hope you guys all did enjoy this video if you did be sure to leave it a massive thumbs up comment down below what you thought and if you guys want me to copy any other celebrities what i eat in a days then let me know who and obviously if you guys aren't already then make sure to subscribe to my channel and i shall see you all very soon with a new one